Hi everyone, I would like to show you what Microsoft Teams actually look like on a computer and how to use it briefly. So first of all, you need to install Microsoft Teams on your computer. And then this is how it looks like when you open it. So first of all, let's start from the activities here. So these are the activities my Teams and I are working on and discussing about mm -hmm. our project. And then you can see checked. So you can chat with each of your group member here individually. And then you will see teams, which is like a chat group. These are my team and I are I'm talking about our project in group. And this is about our in instructional video creation. And this is a group conversation. And then these are the files you can share and uh, edit and work on a group together. Work all of these uh, slices in group together and let's go back and you can also create uh, your own channel so to create your own channel you click on these three dots here and then add channel and I will name this channel TED2 and then here you can also uh, chat in group share the files and edit together work on a group ask for more expansion you can click on this plus sign here and you will see a lot of channels you can choose anything you want and edit uh, in your channel to share your group members for example i choose youtube because that's the most familiar to me and you can paste a link of a video for example uh, this is a current video I am watching. I copy the link and then paste it here. You just have to give some time to load. And then click on the search and then it shows up saved. This way there will be another channel appear and the video is showed here and your team and you can watch the video. Next is calls. You can communicate with each of your group member or all of your group members at the same time. You know, what you have to do is just to type the name, for example, Su Monpyo, which is one of my group members. So I click her name. You can call her and then you can video chat with her here. Next is files. You can upload a PDF Word, Excel, or Microsoft PowerPoint files and edit them and uh, work on a group together. If your storage is running out and you can add cloud storage, you can you know, use your Google Drive and Dropbox and many others. And additionally, you can also uh, use this on your uh, mobile phone. You just have to install Microsoft Teams and work on it very efficiently. Okay, this time I would like to demonstrate how to screen share by using Microsoft Teams. So first of all, click open the Microsoft Teams. So I am going to call Masumon uh, and share something on my screen. So, so now Masumon and I are connected and now I'm going to start sharing my screen. So you click this icon, click it. So now in Masumon's computer, my screen is shared and she can see what's doing on my computer. So I'm going to go back to Microsoft Teams because I would like to show her some files. So these are the presentation slides. So now I have shared my screen enough and now I'm going to stop sharing. So you click this one, stop presenting. So screen sharing is totally stopped and I am going to end the call. Okay, in this video, I will show you how to work on a project by using Microsoft Teams with your group. So first of all, make sure your internet connection is connected and then click open Microsoft Teams application. And I'm going to script and then this is the project that we are working on uh, to uh, write down the answers for each question so there are three people on live 
So S P is Su Mampio, D is Diana, and Su is me, Su Yedana. And what we are doing is we are uh, taking care of uh, giving the answers for each uh, question. So I am uh, doing my part by writing the questions here. So yeah, Masumon is uh, writing the answers and I can see uh, she is doing that. This is Diana, she's also working on her own part. So this is how it works. Uh, I can also edit if I want to other people's answer, for example, like this. Okay, thank you very much for watching this video and I hope you understand how to use Microsoft Teams. Okay, uh, I really love this application because I can see my colleagues working together on the same document. So this is very lively and it's sort of fun and the working environment is more enjoyable than before. Well, I really love using team conversation because it is easy to work on group project. We don't need to gather as a team to work. And we can just create in team and chat on live video and call from anywhere. And I can share my screen as well as my friend can share their screen on what we are doing and what we want to show. By using team conversation, we can save our time. That's why I would recommend using this application for better user experience. Thank you.